Fan repair. Some may consider it a dying or inefficient business. However, one man has decided not to quit the business. 60-year-old Brian Rowe, also known as Fan Man, has been repairing broken fans for the past 12 years. Headline News caught up with the ardent businessman who spoke about the love for his profession. I put all my interest in it, my very best foot in it. And I thank God for this work that I am doing. I put my trust in God. Rowe did various jobs before he learned his trade by watching a friend fix the fan. He has not regretted his choice as he conducts his business in front of his lot 165 Meadowbrook home. I normally don't but six fans a day. I can't always a problem. Six a day, sometimes eight fans a day. What are some of those complaints? Well, most of them my complaints are the people who tell me are taking too long, taking too long with the fan. Sometimes I told them I can find a motto for the fan, and that's not my job. Once I bring the fan and I say it ain't working, me supposed to tell them I can find a motto for it because I put myself in jeopardy. Roe also shared advice to persons when purchasing a fan. That super deluxe fan, the Chinese fan is not good. It's not strong. Last call fan is a good, better fan, and the West Spine fan is good fan. It's more economical to fix a fan than to just buy a new fan. That's right. Once you could take fixing. And how long will the fan last when you fix it? Then I, I fix it not for, a, not for a short while. Not for a short while because most of the people spend the past in it showing me thumbs up. Because, yes, yeah, they show me thumbs up. They say, man, you're a good fan, man. <laughs> you know how? You know how much, you know, people come and give me a nice greetings. Yes, yeah, they say, you're a good fan, man, buddy. If you may have a fan that you're considering to fix, you can contact Ro on 619-5262. For Channel 2 Headline News, Esther Sobers.